Hello everybody and welcome back to another video. So I haven't been posting lately because I have visitors. My sister has come into town. So she is right here, ladies and gentlemen. Please welcome her. Hi. That is a horrible English. Please. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. Hi. Why don't you tell people your name? Um, my name is Yadilis Cortez. And yes, I have a different last name than he does. Mm -hmm. I mean, technically, that was my last name, but I'm married, so I changed it. I'm going to be doing the sister tag. You can also check out the brother tag, which I'll put down in the description, which you should also check out my sister's channel, which has a very good channel. And I'm also going to put that down in the description. So what is the most expensive thing you've broken? Um, I didn't necessarily like break this item, I guess. I crashed it. It was a car and it was in my car. So I guess, yeah. That's pretty tough. <laughs> <laughs> what is the thing you feel most grateful for? um definitely my family um i actually speak a lot about this like on my channel because i have a tattoo that says family on it i actually have a matching tattoo with our sister so if you could only eat one food for the rest of your life what would it be um if i wanted to say like me being like a fatty i'd probably say like french fries because i love french fries from like every place but if i wanted to say like on the healthier side probably like mangoes because it's like one of my favorite fruits I like mangoes too. I like the dry mangoes. Mm -hmm. Those are good. Or what makes you laugh the most? Um, just about everything. I'm a very like giggly person, so literally like the smallest thing and I'll laugh. Even if like you fall down, <laughs> I will laugh before <laughs> I say like, are you okay? So if you could describe yourself in five words, what would they be? Um, humble, um, probably like a clown just because I'm always like saying like the most random like jokes ever grateful sassy and friendly because even though I am sassy like I there is like a friendly side to me so what is your favorite holiday Christmas which yes. is right around the corner and this year I'm not getting anything <laughs> I started Christmas early <laughs> <laughs> what's your favorite music genre um probably reggaeton because we are from puerto rico so like mm -hmm. i don't know i we both speak spanish and all of that which you already know from like watching his videos but and i just love she it also videos in spanish as well i do yeah. i do i need to do more yeah you should do you prefer coffee or tea um probably coffee i feel like tea just tastes like watered down juice so if you could compare yourself to one fictional character who would it be um probably mulan just because she's kind of seen like, I don't know, like the un, is that a word? I was going to say some crazy <laughs> word, but like, I don't know. She's like not perfect. Um, she's not the perfect daughter. So like, I just feel like I can compare it to her a lot. I did a lot when I was younger. So definitely still the same character. Would you rather go out on a Saturday night or stay in? Um, stay in because I am a homebody. Good choice. Me too. <laughs> Do you enjoy being out in nature? Um, it's kind of like, I don't know. Like I do when I don't just because like, I don't know. Like I want to go like camping and all of that and like stay in a tent and all of that. But I don't like bugs. So it's kind of like, eh. But I guess yes. When are you most yourself? Um, probably once I'm like comfortable like in a relationship or like around my family um or even like talking to myself like to the camera when i'm recording myself that's usually when i'm like the most comfortable like being myself and like just joking around and all of that yeah i completely agree with that if you could bring one mythical creature to existence which would it be um i think dragons because it would be pretty cool to have like your own like pet and like driver at the same time you don't have to have a car pay bills and, and protect her yes and protect that'd her. be pretty cool what is the most ridiculous thing you've ever bought mm, i don't know if it's like ridiculous but it was just like the way that i paid for it i guess um i used my credit card to buy um tickets to universal studios for like the day portion and then it was like horror night so i like spent money again to buy the tickets and it was like i was buying for two people so i was like four tickets in one day on my credit card mm. 
which it wasn't really ridiculous we had fun but it was just like the fact that i put it on my credit card yeah and to this day i haven't paid it off <laughs> <laughs> if you could win the lottery what would be the first thing you would buy um not necessarily buy but i think i would just pay off my debt first but i mean if we were to talk about like buying i'd probably um i have a house in california so i'd probably just pay it off and then that way i can make money off of that what languages do you wish you could speak um i definitely like french fun fact in sixth grade i was supposed to take french and i think it was like just too hard for me so i only stayed for like two weeks but I definitely regret like quitting because it seems like a fun language to learn. What songs hit you with the feeling of nostalgia? Um, definitely like probably like bachata songs because they're just like pretty much all about like romance and just kind of like getting your heart broken. And obviously, just listening to songs like that makes you get in your feels. So, yeah. what is your favorite word to say? No. <laughs> Because like I said earlier, I'm a sassy person, so everything to me is no, no, no. I don't want to do it, so definitely my favorite. Would you rather be able to speak to animals or speak all the languages in the world? Um, I think speak all the languages in the world. Just because, like, I don't know, I'm a talkative person, and it would be kind of cool to just be able to talk to, like, everyone instead of just, like, using Google Translate. And then you don't understand what the other person is saying because as we all know google translate does not translate words it's very true <laughs> the right way and the last question is if you could delete one application forever what would it be um probably snapchat just because like i didn't have it for like two years i mean i had it for years and then i deleted it for two years didn't have it and then i just got it again so i did perfectly fine without it so but please go check out her channel she has great content. I'm going to put it down in the description. And please remember to like and subscribe and hit that notifications bell to stay tuned in with all my content. Thank you so much. And bye, guys. Bye.